In my 20s, I would almost always be working in hospitality a lot, like, you know, six days a week, 10, 15 hours a day, and then writing in my hours off or, or working in retail. And so I'd be sort of making a combination living of um, some money from grants, some money from commissions, and then some money from working. And then, and then I was really lucky and, and, and started, for a while what I would do is I would take on maybe four commissions a year and a commission, back then it was maybe eight or $10,000, I think now it's $12,000, which sounds like a lot of money, except that you're working on it for a couple of years. And so one commission a year wasn't enough to make a living by, but if I was doing like four or five plays a year, I could, or three even, like I, some years, you know, you had more money than others, then I would, um, I'd be able to kind of make a living on that. And then last year, I had a really great year because how you really can kind of make money as a playwright is through royalties. And if a lot of people come and see a play, then you get, you get a 10% cut of the box office. And say you've got a long season and a big theater and a lot of people see the play, you end up, you can have a really good year and making a lot of money. Last year, I made the most money I've ever made. Unfortunately, I didn't quite realize that it wasn't, oh, I was just sort of like, oh, well, from now on I have money, that's great. And I spent all of it mainly on psychics. And so now I'm sort of back in like my, um, now I'm kind of back in that state of going, oh, how, how am I gonna make some money? Where, but for a little while, I, yeah, really, I, it was really fun. <laughs>